In this tutorial, we will cover how to use the Join Path Points tool and the Cut Paths Shape tool. The Join Path Points tool is used to merge two shapes into one. It does this by connecting a point or node from the first shape to a point on the second shape. When the Join Path Points tool is active, you will see blue points on the shapes in your quilt pattern. These blue points indicate where one shape can be joined to another. Any shapes created using the rectangle, ellipse, star, or polygon tool will have to be converted using Convert Shape to Path before they can be joined. For more on Convert Shape to Path, see the Convert Shape to Path tutorial. To join two shapes, click and hold on a blue point of the first shape, then drag it near a blue point on the second shape. As the two come closer together, a red line will appear, indicating that they will join together. Release the mouse button. The two shapes are now joined. Cut Path Shapes is used to cut lines into smaller segments, similar to the way a pair of scissors would cut a string. Just as with the Join Path Points tool, any shapes created using the rectangle, ellipse, star, or polygon tool will have to be converted using Convert Shape to Path before they can be cut. With the Cut Path Shapes tool active, click and hold anywhere outside of the shape you want to cut, then drag the mouse across the shape. This red line shows where lines of your shape will be divided. When you are ready to cut the lines, release the mouse button. The shapes are now divided into two. So, in summary, the Joint Path Points tool allows you to merge shapes, while the Cut Path Shapes tool allows you to divide them. 